she spent hundreds of millions of dollars on negative ads on me, many of which are absolutely untrue. And the only gratifying thing is I saw the polls come in today, and with all of that money, we over $200 million dollars is spent, and I'm either winning or tied, One and I've you. spent practically nothing. All right, well, he is in a tight race here. Uh, that was, of course, before the debate, even though she is Hillary Clinton outspending him five to one. However, did the debate change things? Uh, does it get more people to pony up some dough to help Donald Trump out or to help Hillary Clinton out? To GOP fundraiser Noel Nickpour, GOP donor John Tatum, he was at the big event last night. Democratic strategist Capri Kafara. Uh, all right, Capri ended with you. What do you think? Will it move and, and the fundraising needle? Caparo. I apologize, <laughs> Senator. You're absolutely right. Um, from your vantage point sure. in Ohio, where, mm -hmm. where obviously there's been... We're carpet bombs. We always right. are because we're a swing state. And also, Hillary Clinton is, is in a fight there. Absolutely. Will this change it fundraising-wise? Uh, not necessarily. I mean, you know, they have been neck and neck for, you know, the last several weeks. Uh, you know, I come from northeastern Ohio, which is, a, you know, pretty traditional blue-collar Democrats where Donald Trump is playing incredibly well. Uh, you know, Hillary Clinton is on all day, every day. Priorities USA is as well, um, you know, throughout the Buckeye State. But I think that, you know, Donald Trump, while he's getting tremendous traction doing uh, earned media, obviously, which is why he hasn't really spent very much in a traditional manner, right. um, he needs to to be aware of the fact that um, there are other, you know, avenues. You are your A and E, your USA Network, your Prime Time. You know, your adjacencies to Dancing with the Stars, and and you know, you're not necessarily going to reach those kind of audiences unless you actually make a media buy. Well, he's been doing something right right now, but he's been getting away without having to do what the senator pointed out, John. Now the question is, does he have to start doing that? Does he have to start? spending money and where's he going to get the money and I'll talk to Noel about this because there are indications he's not getting it. What do you mm -hmm. think? Well, I, I think you're right, Neil. I mean, he will start spending some money in key battleground states, but, you know, all the advertising in the world can't help a bad product. And I think about New Coke, and they put a lot of advertising behind New Coke, and it didn't work. So, well, I, I won't go there because it's <laughs> near and dear to my heart. But uh, but I think, uh, I think, Neil, you know, Mr. Trump's doing fine. And I can tell you, I was at Trump Tower 30 minutes ago, and the phones were ringing. There was a very upbeat m mood, and uh, and I think we're going to be very successful. What do you think of that? I think Trump's fine. I think he's going to be fine. I do agree with you on that. There, there is a lack of money. I mean, I've talked to donors that are always active, and they're That's sitting on enough, their right? checks. I mean, now maybe to the senator's point, it could, but it, it hasn't. It uh, hasn't. It hasn't hurt him. But I'm. That money is for what? In Hillary's case, it's just to get the vote out, right? But if they're not jazzed about you. She, it's not going to happen. She has more of a burden because she has a lousy record that she has to defend. She also has a connectability problem. Mm -hmm. so Did she, she is, connect last night? Whatever no, I don't think she connected last night. I think that she was a policy hawk. I think that she had knew figures and facts and names, and, and it made her look book smart. But it doesn't help move the needle on, on warming her up. Right. I mean, I, I think that, I mean, you know, I'm a Democrat, but I call it like I see it. And I think that that has been one of the consistent problems that Hillary Clinton has had. She doesn't have relatability. She's got a trustworthiness problem. She did as good as I think she could do last night in the debate as far as, you know, trying to, um, on one hand, show a command of issues, but at the same time not totally laugh off Donald Trump. It was a very delicate balance. Yeah, uh, she did avoid the Al Gore trap. The, the, the eye rolling, the, right. the, the shying. But what do you think of that? Well, I, I think Mr. Trump left a lot of points uh, out there. There were, you know, for a golf analogy, he could have had a few birdies, <laughs> and uh, yeah. we got some pars. Um, but I think but there, when you were at the Trump Tower, there, no one was freaking out about oh, it. Oh no, not. absolutely not. I mean, if anything, I think a lot of his team wanted him to be a little tougher on her. And uh, why didn't he, if the reports are right, listen to them? Well, I, I don't know that he didn't listen to him. I think he, he you know, I, not not for sure they didn't listen to him. But yeah. I think Mr. Trump, look, this campaign, Neil. He's gotten this far. He's exactly. Doing it his way. Right. Exactly. Yeah. One Real of, quick. One of the things that he could do as a fundraiser is you can take a couple of good clips that he had on taxes and whatnot, mm -hmm. and you can mail Great. these to donors, and yeah. you can say, you know, with your help of X amount of dollars, we can go to the finish line. So take some of the good points he did from the debate and spin it to where you can raise money off that. Yeah.
But uh, there are two more debates, right? Yeah, exactly. that's right. And Barack Obama started out lousy, right? That's right. That's, that's yeah. what the poll showed last time. Joe Frazier, you know, he yeah. started out lousy. <laughs> Wait till Vegas. Right? Michael right. Buffer is going <laughs> to open it. All right. <laughs> uh, so the opposite. Joe Frazier won, and then the next two bouts on Exactly. This is all on free basic cable. Uh, guys, thank you very, very much.